Winter 2022 is almost here, and with it come Burden's new step-on bindings. We're here for a quick look at the models Burn has to offer for Winter 2022 step-on bindings. At first glance, the bindings haven't changed much, and in my opinion, they were already pretty awesome to begin with. But we do have a couple of new things that Burton added this season. Let's take a look. All models have the same reflex base plate that lets you set it up on any board in the market. Above it, the same shock absorbing footbed. We have the heel cup with the hook in the back and the two hooks in the front near the toes. You step in, engage with the double click in the heel, click the two toes, and you're done. Then of course you have the same release lever on the side. You pull the lever up, step out with your heel first, and once you're out, it'll bounce back down, ready to engage again. All models have high backs with the same forward lean adjustment with the two screws on the inside of the high backs. Using a number two Phillips screwdriver, you can independently adjust them according to your riding style. But here is what Burden changed this year, the new 2.0 toe plate. This updated version is easier to engage and gives you a much smoother experience when clicking in. But I'm guessing the main thing many people would find important with the 2.0 is a significant reduction in the clicking noise. Everyone was talking about those clicks you hear while riding. Does it click when it's warmer? Does it click when it's colder? Although I didn't find it that annoying, I know many who did. The other upgrade that Burton added this year are the two new models for the Stepons, the Women's Escapade and the Men's Genesis. If you checked out Burton's bindings before, you probably heard about these models from the regular strap bindings, but now they're also available for the Stepons. Here we have the Women's Escapade Step-on binding. Like the Genesis, these are the upscale premium version of the regular Step-on bindings with a slight extra cost. Similar to the regular Escapade or Genesis bindings, you'll get the kickback hammock that increases the response and the comfort without adding any stiffness as you'll see in a bit with the step on x along with these 2.0 toe cleats you get a pretty awesome premium binding so if you'd like the slightly more comfortable premium binding and you don't mind the extra cost the escapade or the genesis will be the right choice for you in addition to the new Escapade and Genesis, Burn continues to offer the same base models released in previous years, the regular Step-Ons and the Step-On X. So just a few words on that. The Step-On X is considered the stiffer and more aggressive binding out of the two. To be clear, I hear a lot of people thinking it's better or worse. Well, it's neither. When you choose any snowboarding gear, make sure you choose something that supports your riding style and level. There's no right or wrong here, but just in general. If your board and boots are more on the softer side and you prefer for more freedom and less response, or whether you are a charger looking for speed and have highly responsive and aggressive boots and board, then your bindings should match one or the other. But just remember, there's a lot of flexibility here, going one way or the other. For example, I ride Burton's Camber Feel Good, a fairly aggressive board with the Felix boots, both of which are considered medium to high stiffness. I use the regular Step-Ons, which are rated medium stiffness. The only difference is that the Step-On X would be more stiff and less flexible. For me, that works perfectly well. I can still carve aggressively and at the same time go to the park or work on my butters between runs. If you're looking for more in-depth information on finding the right snowboard for you, check out my video on snowboards types and comparison in the link up here. Burton categorizes the X stiffness as high. They have carbon blend high backs, making them lighter than the regular step-ons. So the X will have less twist and give and the most response you'll get from the bindings. This is the only significant difference between the two. Okay, here you go. The three models for the winter 2022 Burton step-on bindings. You can find the links to these products in the description and let me know if you have any questions in the comments below.